hello guys this is mustafa and uh, today in this video tutorial i am going to show you python installation on windows machine okay so basically python is reinstalled on uh, linux and macintosh machine but in uh, order to install python on windows machine we have to download the python environment okay so basically we can download it from the python website which is highlighted in the url okay so according to your specific requirements of your uh, os which is 64 bit or 32 bit depending on your machine you can download the particular installer okay so mine is 64 bit okay so i will um, install uh, combine x68 and 64 bit msi installer okay so I, once i click this the dialog box opens for downloading downloading it okay so duplicate download link i have already downloaded it and uh, already installed it so i will not going to do this once again okay it's very easy to uh, download it and install it okay so you can do it this much okay i hope so after installing it okay the after downloading and installing it you will find in the there is a python 3.3 folder okay in your taskbar in your startup taskbar okay which will have idle python gui model docs python command and etc all these five uh, icons and uh, contain containing in this folder okay so basically this is idle python gui which is basically a uh, python framework uh, sorry python ide okay which is integrated development environment so those who are aware, aware of ides uh, will know what uh, what is it what is an ide and all that stuff but uh, for those who are not aware of ides uh, ides are basically uh, integrated development environment which provide a gui phase gui kind of interface for writing codes okay basically it will provide you for better indentations it will suggest you for the basic syntax and um, uh, the directory structure and all that stuff will be very much uh, easier for you there is a syntax highlighting feature which is not there in the notepad as a regular notepad okay. so so now after installing it okay, we will uh, set up an environment variable which is already set up by me okay so what is the use of this what is the use of setting the environment variable okay the use of setting environment variable is that we can access the python from any directory we want using command line okay so here is it uh if i uh, uh type in python okay so i will get this python 3.30 which i now i am into python okay which is basically in c drive so i am in users and uh, into mustafa hussein right so that is basically not a directory of python but instead uh, but then too i am able to access python why because i have set up an environment variable okay so in order to set up an environment variable what i will do is that i will look for the path okay here in system variables i will look for the path here is a path okay and uh, at the end of it okay so you will find something like this kind of stuff okay and uh, at the end of it what you know what you need to do is just type a semicolon which means you are starting off with a new environment variable okay and just give the path of the directory okay part of the directory which is in python 33 python 33 sorry i have misspelled it python 33 okay and then click okay 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 then restart your cmd and all will be fine for you okay let's have a check again very bad at spelling sorry okay so we have this python 3.30 again okay which was already pre-installed from my machine i was just going to show you how to do it okay so this was a basic uh, idea of this tutorial to set up and uh, to how to install python in on windows machine hope you like this tutorial okay if you have any doubt installing python then please comment it okay uh, i will uh, Answer to your comment as early as possible. Okay, hope to see you in another tutorials. Goodbye.